Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Uh, my face looks a little weird because I'm not wearing the uh, the normal head. Um, but that's also because in Oaklands, it does the, the... And I'm thinking about not using a face cam in Oaklands and just using my avatar's face. I like turn to the camera and look at you whenever I'm talking, stuff like that. But anyhow, I am in a private server today and we are playing Lumber Tycoon 2. Yes! How many of you were like, yes, go to the Lumber? <clears throat> <laughs> but I also realized everything that I've ever done tutorials on is done. Is this game has no more secrets for me. So what I like is the physics. All right, and here's something that I personally have kind of been missing: building things because of the physics engine inside Roblox. I mean, literally, I, I thought about this the other day. I don't play lumber because it's lumber. I play lumber because it has the build system in it. I don't play Oaklands because it's Oaklands. I play Oaklands because it's got a building system in it. Everything that I've done. Second Life. Before I played Roblox, I was inside Second Life doing Second Life things. Like, think of Second Life like Roblox for adults, right? You gotta be 18 plus to even get into the game, or 16 plus. I don't remember what the the deal is but that's that's the dealio today and what i want to do is this i have been trying to figure out how to get a ball up get the ball up right and there's been lifter systems that people have used hatches for and it like lifts it up i've never seen a conveyor belt able to do that right but if you look it has influence so there is influence there. It is rolling, right? And this, because it's rolling this way, means those rollers are going this direction, which is pushing down. So if I switch directions, it's gonna push away, isn't it? It'll push away, but the direction is up. Oh, oh come here, okay. And I gotta be careful, because I think I've only got like one ball on this entire, no, I got some more. Okay, and I got some pins too. <laughs> Did I get a bowling ball? Can't remember if I got a bowling ball or not. Anyhow, if not, that's cool. We'll, we'll play with it later. I want to try and figure out. So if you try and build on conveyor belts, it gets restricted by the, um, the bounding box, the, the hit box. It'd be one half wedge, right? because it only goes up by one unit. Ooh, that's a long one. That's one and one third by one. Is there a long one of these? That's a one, that's a one three. It's still only one unit though. So if I go rotate, turn, 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 rotate, turn, rotate, 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 turn, turn, rotate, rotate. Yeah, so even this isn't going to be a big enough for a small enough gap to push against. The idea is I want to take and pressure the ball against the conveyor belt so the conveyor belt will push against it. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. Okay, so this isn't going to work. Let's go ahead and destroy it. I am gonna need the wires and I don't want to have the fence anymore. I know, you guys are like, code, you spent so much time on it. I know, and I even had like a whole bunch of people helping me out. I think Fezzik got me a whole bunch of wires. Somebody got me a whole bunch of wires. Anyhow, no, it, it might've been Jeremy. Jeremy? I don't even remember. One of, one of my members or sponsors or, or staff, somebody like was playing. Um. Okay, let's do this, let's do this. What is this? Okay, this was for the Halloween stuff. Um, let's put that wedge back. Rotate, turn, rotate, turn, rotate, turn, turn. Okay, let's do a bigger one. Bigger one than that. B, destroy it. Whoa, get back here. Don't you go anywhere. So, um, let's see, that's one one third. Where's the half? That's two fourths. Actually, it won't matter. It's it's a ramp down onto it. So 
There's a half wedge. That's what I was looking for. Okay. So that's going to be as close as I can get it. If I do one, two, three, four, B. And you know what? I've got a, a lot of blue wood here. So let's just do, let's do blue wood. That'll be fun. There's one. There's two. There's three, four. And I think that one might not be a full square, so I'm gonna smack some of that off of there for him. Is that enough? Yeah, that's good. Let's see if this was enough. It was, we're good there. All right, one more and last one. Oh, last one, there we go. Okay, so if I have wires like this, one and then I have one like this hold on I'm trying to figure out the physics behind this that might be too steep what are we attaching to that first little bar right there hold on I need to measure come here you oh I don't know if I can grab that can we kick it Maybe. Oh, all right. Hold on. Come here. Oh. That way, sir. That way. Hmm. That might not work. What if we, oh, 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 what if we like stood it off of the the thing? But I need to see how far off to stand it. Burr, 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 burr. All right, so right about there works. Oh, I'm gonna have to have that same uh, angle distance, aren't I? Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Here, 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 here. What if I just do at the very edge of that? And the edge of that will be the edge of the thing, so I could just do another one at the edge up here. All right, so let's do this. Let's build again. Since we're right at the edge here, we need one right at the edge up there. Whoa, I can't zoom out, can we? Out, there we go. One half wedge. That should give me a, a nice measurement. So, let's see. If we're right at the edge, right? We need to go to right on the edge. Oh, what if I did this like right here? Why is it not letting me place? Is it going through the ball? B. Let's go back over here. <laughs> Sorry if my nose is making funny sounds. I had a cold. It's gone now, but... Alright. That uh, doesn't look quite right. I need something to press down on the top of the ball. Ooh, idea. Okay, okay. Let's hit B. Pull this over here. Move. Right at the edge. And right at the edge. Finished. So. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's do this. I'm going to move this. I'm going to kick the ball over. 
Come on. No, 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 no. Don't get spinning. Don't go crazy. Don't go crazy. No. Okay. If I just drop this, move B. Ooh, ooh, okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. Idea, idea. All right, let's do this. Right there, and right there. Finished. Okay, okay. I need another, another one. So if we grab this one, move. And that's going to be right in the way, isn't it? Come here, ball. Thank you. Move. Do the same thing on the side. We're going to go here. And... There. Finished. Okay. So. Now I should be able to just drop this on here. And let's do move, tap, B. Uh-oh. Move. Ah! Punk. <laughs> All right, come here. Should there be another one behind it, you wonder? I wonder? Hmm. Oh, wait. Hold on. Can I do this? Move this whole thing. Put this back and press B. Well, that kind of worked. Well, no, it didn't work. But, wait. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Wait a second. Could I do a zigzag pattern, maybe? Hold on. Let's get this out over here. Burp, 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 burp. Experiments. I love experiments. Roblox experiments with physics. Oh, not B. I need to press E. Move. There we go. Okay. So, let's grab one of these. Move. Is that a big enough angle? Well, it's locked in there, isn't it? And it is sort of sliding. Kinda. Whoa, okay, okay. We're figuring something out here. What is this? What is this doing? Okay, okay. Let's try something. Move. Grab. Pull this out. I don't want to lose it. B. Let's make a third one here. Ooh, it's raining outside. I love the rain. Ooh, there we go. It's because I was making it on blue, all that neon is getting in my eyes. Alright. Right there. And... Whoa, 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 whoa. Right there. Oh, way off. Right there. It's kind of an angle. It's fine. Oh wait, that was on the the conveyor belt, not the uh, piece of wood at the top. I always feel like there's some kind of like fisheye angle to the uh, to the camera. Okay, that's way off. So let's go right there. Finished. Okay, one, two, three. Now we can move this. Move. Grab the bow. Come here, bow. Place it against that and B. Ooh, 
We might just have a conveyor belt. Very slow. <laughs> but feasible. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, we gotta figure that out. Okay. So figure that one out. That'll be fun. Let's go back over here. Let's uh let's experiment on the next one. There we go. Oh, oh, oh gosh. Come here. Nope. Come here. Hmm. Not working. No, wait. We could do it with doors, I think. Hold on. Hold, hold up, yo. Let's try something here. Let's go to two. Um, I need a floor, a tiny tile. This is just for measurements. All right, and build a tiny tile up here at the top. There we go. Now I don't actually need this one. Hold on, can I even reach that? Yeah, there we go, there we go. All right, so let's grab one cord. Corner, oh, oh, maybe. Corner to where is it at? Oh, I can't see it. Corner to corner, finished. Now let's go grab another one. Oh, did I just kick the ball? <gasps> I did. Sorry. Come here. Here, let's put you in there. Oof. Do not want to lose that thing. Oh, come on. Move. Experiments! Could primate labs back at it. The main thing about this game is the, the controls. Just get used to like the build controls. If you happen to be playing on Xbox, I do apologize. The controllers are a bit messy. But they are doable. I have signed bases on Xbox controllers before. There's two. And three. This is gonna take forever, code. I know. Right on the edge. Right on the edge. Whew. Last one. Last boat. Huh, I wonder if I should just keep it with three. Hold on, let's see if the ball fits in there. I don't think it will. I thought that was a pink candy at first. Ball is not gonna fit in there. What in the world? Hold on, hold on. We just saw a little trick. What was that doing? That is kind of crazy. Whoa, buddy. Come back here. Mm, so we will not be able to put it in there like that. Just not fast enough. I can't. I can't grab past it. That just stays right on point, doesn't it? Oh snap! 
Okay. And let's hit B. <laughs> kind of worked, kind of didn't. All right. Um, let's do this. Let's move one of these right here. So we're still doing the trifecta kind of thing. Finished. But check this out. All right. We're going to move and grab at the same time. There we go. And now I'm going to hit B. <laughs> Got it. I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> <laughs> now that I've got it built, <laughs> what were you planning on doing, Code? I have no clue. But does it look amazing? It does. It looks absolutely amazing. Okay, hold on. Uh, how many are they up to now? Does anybody know the number before I open this one? Take your guess. Leave your comment below. What number do you think this ball is going to be? Um, this one is 59846, and it was opened fairly quickly. So, 59 is the current. Just an orange box, isn't it? Alright. Open! What number we get? What number we get? 106,955. That's how many times this thing's been opened. Alright, so, this we should be able to go move. Oh, 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 I gotta do the, the little trick, don't I? Oh, it's too close to close. All right. So, oh, just one out. Press E. Move click. Awesome. All right. <laughs> nice. Again, I have no clue what I'm supposed to do with this. The physics engine is freaking out. Like, what are you doing? See, this is what I kind of wanted the conveyor belt system to do. But I think it just, it rolls down the conveyors too fast. Oh, wait, let's try it at this angle. Oh. Give it a try. Give it a try. All right. Uh, let's do two. We did tiny tile. And if we turn, let's leave the tiny tile on the ground. Would that help at all? Hold on. That would be... Okay. Let's try one. Let's try just one. And can I go ahead and move this? Move. Mm, rotate, turn, rotate, turn, rotate, turn, rotate, turn, rotate, rotate, turn, turn, rotate, turn, rotate, rotate, rotate. There we go. <laughs> that code that took you forever. I know. Uh, but it'll make the rest of them okay. All right. So I don't have any more angles. So that's my first angle. And we're going to two. O to go out, tiny tile, turn. All right, so that's going to be our angle of attack. <coughs> our angle of influence? Angle, It's that's our angle. All right, I want to build up here, the tiny corner. By the way, um, I am tired, if you guys can't tell. I didn't record yesterday. Um, I had the collaboration with uh, the official brick, which, by the way, amazing, fun time. I loved being able to do the duels, uh, dual premieres at the same time. That was cool. If you guys didn't see that, you gotta go watch. You can put up both both of them side by side. Oh, that's a that's a neon, isn't it? What is that? Is that a blue neon? I don't even know. It's not a wire. Need a wire wire. There we go. Anyhow, I felt bad about no Subnautica. Come on, on the corner. To the corner. Oh. Come on. 
finished. All right, here we go. We should be able to destroy that. Let's go get another ball. I'll just open up the presents while I'm at it. A lot of people are like, oh, don't open them. It decreases the value. It doesn't, I mean, didn't do anything to it. <sighs> I'm, I'm just not a collector like that. I'm sorry. Move, hold, nope, nope, hold, and B. No way. Slowly, slowly, but that's working. Oh, did you get stuck? You got stuck. Is it getting stuck on the one in between the two? It is, it's getting stuck on that last one just before the next. That is so cool. All right, let's go ahead and move. Grab that out, drop, B. I have an idea. What if we put a third one right on top of that one? E, move, done. I'm not gonna be able to put up there, am I? What if I do right here? Okay, what if I do <laughs> right here? There we go. And I don't know what this angle is going to look like on the outside, but too much. Too much. Too much. Basically what I'm doing is I'm lining up here, setting it, and then checking that angle. I want it to be as close as possible. No, 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 that was a good one. I like that one. It was a good angle. Oh, too little. Come back some. We'll do that. We'll do that. Finished. Okay. Can't, can't just get in and in there. Just, okay. So let's move, move, and, oh, and grab. Come on, get in there, and B. Oh, that did not work. There it goes. Hey Defaultio, can you add friction to uh, to the wires? Give it a little bit of friction so it catches. Hmm. You're not allowed to build on other connection or other hit boxes, right? And what I'm talking about with this is move. You guys see. You see the green box that's around the object? That is called its its bounding box, its boundary box, whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> everything that you place is inside a certain amount of grids. They're all squared and everything else. The wires, however, do not abide by that same grid. They are freeform. Like you, you have a lot more things. These only you move by like a unit at a time unless you're dealing with like tiny tiles and then you can move them like 0.5 at a time or 0.2 at a time or whatever the small angle is. Anyhow, oh it made it off the end. Maybe or was it just just coincidence that I put that back when when it fell. Hold on. Oh, stop it. Stop it, silly gooses. Huh, no, it really popped off the end there. That was awesome. 
experimentations. Wait a second. Wait a second. I'm recording. I know you're recording. I just want to say I love you while you are recording. <laughs> I love you too, bud. I love you, father. Oh, I'm right at 30 minutes, actually. So I'm done recording. Do you want to say outro? <laughs> outro. Yeah. Like that. I got to do the, the rest of the outro. So. Yeah. All right. Bye. Bye, bud. Love you. You too. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2. With me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos. If you can figure out how to get a ball up, I'd love to make a, a Rube Goldberg machine that just will perpetually keep going or not perpetually but you know what i mean don't forget to like comment subscribe down below do all those cool things i'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good youtuber does but it's your choice if you want to go for it if not that's cool too you were here you watched you had fun uh didn't get into a lot of emotions this time so i mean it's it's not like the normal videos where i'm talking to you about your everyday personal life and, and giving you the motivation that you need but it's also friday and well technically it's thursday to me it's friday last day of the week so you got the weekend to look forward to and nobody ate you right you were here you watched and no cannibals came along and, and made you their lunch so very good <laughs> love you guys very much have a great night and we'll talk to you very soon Outro.